Hello guys, welcome back. Today I'm gonna show you how to make a future bass track. So, make sure to like this video, and subscribe to the channel, and let's start the video. Set the tempo to somewhat around 10 BPM, and add an acapella. Why do I feel it? Try too hard not to believe it now. Add some chords. And some pads for atmosphere. Add a bass line. Add exhausts and risers when introducing new elements. At the second part of the intro, add a simple piano melody. And some cinematic drums. And this is how our intro sounds like. Why do I feel it? Try too hard not to believe it now. Cause baby, I feel it. Try to hide, but I see it now. I cut and repeated the vocal to make it a building element for the drop. And I added some build up snares. Add some arps. And a drum fill before the drop hits. I also added this filtered vocal. And this is how our build up sounds like. Start the drop with a kick and some snares and I added these rides at the second part of the drop I added some closed hi-hats and at the third part I added these claps and the build up drums we used before. Add some crashes and some stabs to make the draw feel heavier. Guys, the drop chords consist of six layers. Here's them individually. I side chained them, some distortion, some EQ, some saturation, some multiband compression, some reverb, a volume automation, some tape stop effects, and some LFO automation. I also added these filler chords. Add a simple lead sound like this to support the chords.
I side chained it, and added some saturation. Guys, when making the drop bass, make sure to use 8 or 8 samples. Here's the bass line I used. I just side chained it, and added some EQ. Add that sub bass. I side chained it, and added some EQ. Guys, throughout the second and third part of the track, I kept the arps we used before, and the vocal. So guys, our track is finished. Make sure to like this video and subscribe to the channel, and let's see our final result. Why do I feel it? Try too hard not to believe it now. Cause baby I